Hey guys, welcome back to Glam Finds, and I have again Yumi. So this time we are back. She's going to smell and rate 12 men's signature scents. I'm gonna try to make this fairly quick. She's gonna smell it, she's gonna rate it, and then we're gonna move on. So let's start. Yay! Here's the first one. Oh, I like this one. Yeah. One out of 10. Seven. Seven. I think it's pretty fresh. Yeah. Fresh clean. Legend EDT, guys. Legend EDT mm -hmm. just got okay. a seven out of 10. I feel like that's actually a pretty strong start. It's a Mont Blanc. Yeah, Mont yeah. Blanc, the legend. I had an ex-boyfriend that wore this. Actually, I picked it out because I was like, oh, that one smells good. Honestly, it's really hard yeah. to dislike it. Yeah, it's nice. I Let's like see it. if we can beat a seven with the next one. <laughs> so here's the second one. It's like, it's like really strong. Yeah, it's yeah. definitely really strong. But it reminds me of like, laundry detergent. What? But it's strong. It's definitely strong, yeah. I'm gonna say like six. Yikes. It's like really strong. I don't, I don't know. That's bad? It just smells like really clean laundry, but like on steroids. That's pretty strong. You don't smell like sage? I don't feel like I've ever washed my clothes in sage. I don't know. Uh -uh. I'm gonna say like 5.5. Oh my God, please don't tell me this was your favorite. I mean, it's definitely in my top three, yeah. <laughs> Guys, that's <laughs> YSL YEDP. That is one of my top five most complimented fragrances in my entire collection, just so we're clear. Um, yeah, I mean, maybe it's because it's on paper. That's fair. I guess remember guys, this is all on paper because I'm not going to spray like 12 spots of my skin with this. <laughs> and we just did a video. So that would have been yeah, like 24 sprays on my skin and I, I would run out of space. So on paper, YSL YEDP is a 5.5, but on skin, it's an 11 out of 10. Next. All right, guys, here's the third one. Okay. I like this one better than that one. Okay. 6.5. 6.5, okay. That is Boss Bottled Infinite that nobody talks about ever, but I think is an amazing signature scent. It's super fresh, super clean. It's actually kind of in the same vein as YSL YADP. Um, it's not as beast mode, but it's really, really good. And right now it's coming in two out of three next. Here's the fourth one. Ooh, I like this one. Okay. You may redeem yourself. Eight. Okay. I like it. I would wear this one. Guys, that's Coach uh, for Men EDT, and I think it's an amazing one too. Is that the one you just got? No. Is that the gray one? That's silver, but no. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> It's like black gradient. I like that one. Yeah. Okay, we found good. number one so far. Let's move on and see what else we got. All right, here is the fifth one. I like this one. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. I'm gonna give this one an eight. Another eight? Yeah. Okay. I like it a lot. <laughs> Guys, that's our moth clubbed in a wee siage, which I didn't think she was going to like at all, but that's interesting. It's, yeah, this one's really good. I like this one. Okay. I would want my boyfriend to smell like this. Shocker, but uh, we'll take it. And we'll probably do a tiebreaker at the end with that one and the last one. Next. Next. It's really strong. You don't need to get it that close to your nose. <laughs> Soapy. Yeah, super yeah. clean, yeah. a seven okay yeah it's nice it's clean fresh like linen like yeah i like it seven it's for such a pro i think it's super likable it's really hard to dislike that one so i get it yeah. seven for such pro signature scent really cheap next i don't know 
That one actually smells a lot different on paper and skin because I just smelled it on paper and it's definitely different. But yeah. I don't want to spray my skin right now, so. 6.5. It's yeah. okay. So this one is like a banger on skin. Uh, right now, as of right now, it is actually my number one compliment getter and it's Dior Homme 2020. Oh, okay. I feel like I should spray it on skin, but. Yeah, this is like super hyped. Right? No, everyone hates it except me and like, I, well, everyone hated it except me because I was like, if everyone hates it, I, I'm probably gonna love it. And I did and I, I smelled it first and then I bought it and huge fan. I'm gonna definitely get backup bottles of it because I reach for it all the time. Yeah, I don't know. On skin, I'll spray it on skin later and then okay. we'll, we'll revisit. It, it kind of smells like something like an older gentleman would wear to me. But you did say gentleman. Yeah, like Signature George Sun. Clooney or something. Well, he's not exactly not handsome, so. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> We're gonna take the L on this one on paper, but on skin, this and YEDP probably would have topped the list. Next, next one. What? I like this one. <laughs> <laughs> Out of 10, how much do you like it? I like this, this is like a nine. I really like this one. Guys, she's smelling Prada Lunarosa Ocean. So far one that like I haven't done a full video on because I don't like it enough to <laughs> test it. Like I test yeah. everything, but this one I was just like, I wore it once or twice and I was like, no, nah, I'll, I'll come back to it when I come back to it. <laughs> no, no, you probably like it. That, the, the DNA is super lovable. I just still get a headache Seriously? every time I wear it. It's pretty sweet. I mean, yeah, it's clean I think that's why sweet. I like it. Yeah. Cause I'm like sweet. Yeah, I like it. It's, it's lovable. I mean, we have I would another wear that one, one right now. <laughs> I would wear that one. That's so weird because I tried a product, the one with the red. The sport? And I didn't really like that one. Really? I like yeah. that one more. Oh, okay. <laughs> that one smells like Lamal kind of, but I like it more than Lamal. Oh, okay. Interesting. Not the Le Parfum, the regular oh, Lamal. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. Next. <laughs> oh, I really like this one too. I think I like this one better than that one. That, wait. Oh, wow. Okay. I feel like I've worn something like this, like in the past. That's, it's pretty clean. I mean, I think it's like, I would say it's pretty fruity a little bit. That's probably why I like it. Yeah. Maybe like apples or something. Probably. I haven't even looked into this one. I've never reviewed it. Like DK it might be delicious, but like a men's version. Okay, I can kind of see it. Out of 10? I'm gonna do a nine, because I like this one too. But you like it more than the last one? Yeah, okay, fine, 9.2. Okay. <laughs> Guys, this is Lacoste, uh, Lacoste L1212 white. Oh my God, okay, you know what? what? My manager wears that. That's hilarious. That's why I was like, man, this smells really familiar. familiar. Yeah, because he always wears it. I'm like, damn, Daniel, you smell scent. really, his name is actually Daniel, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, damn, that smells really good. Yeah, I like that one. All right, guys, we got a top of the chart guy and we have three left next. Five. <laughs> Guys, this is Zaharoff's signature pour home. I wasn't sure what she was going to think, but this makes sense. Um, it is a lot of people's signature scent, but I think it's like not for everyone. And it is for someone who's more refined, maybe something it's where you're suit. wearing like, yeah, at least a suit and tie kind yeah. of situation. But yeah. I thought I'd throw it in there anyways. Next. Hmm. It's like soapy too, but it's like, pretty clean. Yeah. Like but in a more like professional way. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna give it an eight. Okay. Yeah, I like it. Yeah, an eight. Solid All right, eight. well, at least you're not breaking my heart. This is Versace Dylan Blue. You guys already know this is my baby. <laughs> okay. um, so this is second to last. Let's see where the last one ends up next. Mm, like seven. Okay. At least none of yours went below five. I mean, I feel like five is pretty low, but yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, I like guess seven. 
So that one is Club Didn't We Intense Man, the EDP, if I'm not mistaken. Okay. Um, I smudged one of the letters off, so, but I think it's the EDP. But we're gonna break this tie real quick and then we're gonna give you top three. <laughs> so number one is gonna be La Classe L1212 White. Number two, you have Prada Luna Rosa Ocean. And somehow in number three, I just threw this decant in because I had it. I had no intention of bringing it. Our moth clubbed in a wee siage. So, so these are the three? No, or, these oh. two lost. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. So these okay. are your top three, guys. Um, comment down below. Let us know what you think of this idea. Um, it's just kind of random. I said, you know, I'm coming down here. Let me do a couple videos with some people that have some uh, Instagrams. See what they think. Because you guys always want people to rate these fragrances. And you know what? Let's do it. Let's keep rating them. Yep. Let me know what you think. Give you me some love. Again, follow her. I'm going to drop her Instagram down below. Thank you guys for watching. Remember to like this video if you liked it. Be subscribed to the channel. Hit that notification bell to get notified when I drop a new video. And I will see you guys on the next one. Bye. Bye.